Hello, my name is John Sveck. I'm the defensive coordinator at St. Francis Xavier University. I'm with uh, Gary Waterman, who's the head coach at St. FX. Uh, we're here at all24.ca, and we're going to do another installment of our One Clip series. Uh, so the One Clip series is all about us choosing a random play, just a random football play, and uh, just breaking it down, just talking some football, uh, talking about what we see in the clip, and just kind of going from there. So how are you feeling about this One Clip there, Coach? Oh, I think it's exciting and looking forward to talking football and uh, not knowing what clip we're going to draw on and having to comment on that. So it helps keep you sharp. And uh, yeah, looking forward to doing it. All right. So we have a very high tech way that we've devised of, uh, of picking this random clip. So I'm just going to run my cursor down the playlist of our library and coach is going to tell me when to stop. Stop. Okay. So we've got our game. This time we have bishops uh, from week two, bishops versus St. FX. And we'll do the same thing one more time, Coach. Stop. Okay, and we have a random play selected here. Uh, looks like a first and 10 play. Uh, looks like it's early in the game, so I'll just get us started here. Uh, so looking at the offensive set, looks like a 32 formation. Again, it's a first and 10, balls on the hash. And the offense is in a pistol set with their running back, so not tipping off where that running back's going to set up where he's going to go pre-snap. So a fairly balanced, uh, fairly standard formation that they can do a lot of different things out of, Coach. Yeah, I mean, uh, it's first and 10, same thing. I would agree with that. Uh, lots of options. They're in a pretty good – once you get down to this range here, you're kind of in that uh, range, you know, that you're almost in field goal range. And, uh, A, you don't want to take negative plays. But, B, uh, you also can be a little more aggressive at times because you feel pretty confident that – uh, you know, you can, you're in score zone here. And so, uh, so uh, defensively, we got, you know, you're looking at tightening things up and you're looking at uh, trying to limit the offense the best you can. So I noticed we've got uh, just uh, covering down receivers as, uh, as normally in the, in the start of the play and see what happens here. All right, let's let it run a little bit. Looks like an inside handoff and about, you know, maybe five, six yard gain. So a, a bit of a standard play again, just lo it looks like an inside zone look. We'll look at it on the tight film. Uh, but just a one back inside zone looks like they're heel lining, reading our backside end. Uh, again, pretty standard football, uh, fair, executed fairly well on the offense, and we've limited it a little bit on the defense there. Uh, just a pretty good, solid football play, Coach. Yeah, it looks like there's some pressure on the defensive side from the Will linebacker. I think the end does a pretty good job of, of that. Uh, you'd like to see his shoulders a little bit more square. I think the quarterback's trying to get a read off. He doesn't see Twitch quite chase so he's going to hand the ball off I think the defensive end does a real nice job of of recovering here and down the line and making the tackle uh you know quarterback does a good job in terms of just making the read looks like they're running uh just a little bit of a bang out by number two with a switch release and trying to see if they get something off the pull if there's a pull but there's no pull read uh to give and so you know it's a six yard game but defense then you know uh stops them and gets to play another down yeah, and just, find, just to finish things on the wide view here, uh, you know, agreed. I see these kind of routes, uh, option routes at the, at the side here, that if the quarterback does pull it, he's got some routes to work with on the rollout. Um, so that's the kind of the two versions of that play that you're going to see based on how the defense reacts. So that's good. I, I'm looking forward to getting to the tight here, Coach. Anything else on the well, wide you want to mention? Yeah, one more thing you notice here, and sometimes in these scenarios here, if you look on the, on the boundary side here, that, that's a little bit uh, post, a pre-snap, uh, option there where they're running a little hitch. So if they get numbers or we don't, if, if the defense does not respond with numbers and they get advantage, they, they may just pull it right. They may not even have a fake, just pull it and throw the hitch to number one on the boundary side, but there's numbers there that are matching and the backer that's kind of expanded. So that probably is a, that pre-snap play is off the table. So now you're looking at the post-snap RPO and you, you can see uh, reading the end uh, uh, and the end gives them a signal to give. Perfect. Let's get to that tight angle here. And obviously the key got to watch here is the D end. He's kind of the, the player that they're reading. It's, it's all going to be based on what he does once they get to that post snap read. So it looks like on defense, they're in a sort of a shuffle mode there. Um, obviously your options, you could shuffle it, you could chase it. A lot of options defensively, how you want to react to this down block away. Um, again, in my, as, as I'm talking to players on this, it's always about, you know, uh, personnel. Right. You need to put yourself in position where if they do give it and bend back, you're close enough to make that play. So uh, we do give up. Uh, the defense does give up probably a few more yards than than would be liked here defensively. 
and they are getting some wash down there on the old line. Uh, but that D end is able to ultimately make the play a little bit downfield. Like you said, the defensive end does a pretty ne- decent job of coming down the edge and making the play and uh, does a good job, of, you know, forcing the give and, and playing football. That's great. Any final thoughts on this uh, one clip coach? No, I think that's, uh, you know, that's football play. And, uh, you know, so, sometimes you're going to have a, a big stop and sometimes you're going to have just a sound, sound play on offense. And so, you know, that's, that's what the game's all about. That's great. So thanks for joining us for this uh, one clip at all24.ca. And we're looking forward to uh, future installments of this series. Have a great day.